we'll see. No, looking like the actual game. Okay, so yeah, uh, one thing that's gonna be so crucial is uh, Duck Hunt's down B, the gunman, blocks all projectiles. Um, every projectile will just get hit by that. Uh, not all projectiles, some go through it, but blocks, I think, all of Samus's projectiles, like that right there, you see? Um, and that's gonna be so huge. That's it's really good at duck for duck hunt in like zoner dittos is having the ability to totally like stand behind something and know you're safe from projectiles, especially train who loves to throw out these missiles. Yeah, Zane's Zane's content with standing there. Ooh, but mixing in a fast missile there actually goes over the can. And right here, um, it's interesting because missiles have an explosion like collateral hitbox. So even if you are behind something, you could still like get clipped by the explosion. Right here. Zane was kind of getting stuffed out by these missiles. But now they're going in right here. And let's see if Train knows how to deal with Duck Hunt's up close pressure, which is Definitely something not a lot of people know. Um, the Saibi frame one, the can frame one, and Duck Hunt has some pretty, like, a really good grab as well. So there's gonna be some things you're gonna have to realize. Oh, so clean right there. Yeah, that was just such a like barrage of projectiles trying to be the first person to get in to get something to kill. And Zane right there, despite being down a lot of percent, was able to get the stock early because Duck Hunt has kill confirms like that. I wonder if that was very good DI from Train. It kind of looked like you were holding away, maybe trying to DI the can, and then got sniped. What's up, guys? It's your boy Numbies back on his bullshit. Numbies on the mic. Once more. Zane at 211% against Samus of all characters. Well, now he's at zero. Now they're at zero, yeah. They're at zero, yeah. sorry. <laughs> um, Our brand sprank a new pronoun, should have reminded me. Oh, yeah. Um, so, yeah. Um, it's going to be it's gonna be really hard, I think. I think this 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 matchup is one that's kind of determined by who takes the first stock. Uh, it depends, obviously, but it, it can be really rough. No, to, you're absolutely correct. Comebacks. When it comes to like two projectile characters fighting each other, first stock matters way more than most matchups. It's like, oh man, I lost, and now I have to get in on this projectile camper with As my non-existent yeah. with my non-existent <laughs> approach options. Yeah, it, it's it's like. The, Zane was at so much percent when they took Train's first stock and then almost did 100 before Train managed to take it. And that's because Samus, as good as their op, um, as their options are, um, they can't really just like have something to totally invalidate Duck Hunt's like, zoning. Indeed. Yeah, especially a character like Duck Hunt specifically because he's just like no to every projectile in the game. Yeah, it's very nice. Duck Hunt is a character that is super strong in zoner dittos. Look at that. Totally does not care about that charge shot. Indeed. on the clock now and the same story is kind of unfolding with um train down to stock and just not able to 
close it out. So Zane, they're getting an insane amount of bonus damage. That is how it is for the projectile matchup. And sadly, most projectile characters, Jesus Christ, Zane, <laughs> come on. Most projectile characters do have good ways of like finishing off the other guy. So this kind of war of attrition is really bad in the ditto. It's the reason why losing your stock is so bad. Because it's like you're probably going to get to kill percent again by the time you kill them. Yeah. And it's like, oh man, everyone can kill in this game. No, it's really interesting, like, watching how Zane just... They were down, like, a, like at 70% at one point on the first stock and just managed to totally change the whole game because they were the first person to close it out. Oh, he dropped the man's pants. Let's go. Yeah, but right here, <laughs> this is definitely going to be the biggest opportunity for Train to make a comeback. The thing is, there is only one man on the clock. So, truthfully, if Zane really wanted to, they can probably just camp out and get a like, near guaranteed win unless Train gets some crazy reads on Zane's defensive options. Yeah, let's go three rolls from oh. Zane. I mean, there, okay. there's your answer. There's your, there's your double parry. Oh, that could have been it. He could have blasted him. He could have blasted him. Yeah. Oh, here we go with the can. Here we that go with the can. That could have been really bad. Bouncing. Oh, my. Oh, oh we check it? those. Aw. Uh, that that would have been, been cool. kind of cool. <laughs> that would have been so cool. Close oh, stuff, right, though. Faces. Oh. Train, um... Train almost brought back right there. I think you're right. That could have been a really high up back air. Like the tip or back air with that much rage on Samus, that would have killed. Oh, I was just talking charge shot. Look at oh, this. Oh, yeah, I see. Yeah. Just look Either at this. Either way, um, uh, what's train, train, on almost, train almost brought that back, truly. So, Indeed. It was um, a very good game. That's, that. yeah. You can, uh, despite the advantage of having a stock lead, I think Samus especially is a character that can kill you really early, so you still got to be careful. Oh, yes. And if Zane is, as we can hear right now, if Zane is playing in a match and Battlefield FD or Small Battlefield is selected and the person who picked it doesn't pick a song, Zane will pick a song for you, and it will be Tekken music. I see. Zane will always, like, prioritize Tekken music on these stages, and I respect that. But that's not good. Train's giving Zane the music counterpick, even though it's Train's stage counterpick. That's no good. Okay. Yeah, Zane will always have his Tekken music on. If he picks the stage or if the opponent picks it and doesn't pick a song, it's going to be Tekken music. Which I'm content with, honestly. The That's fine. Very, very pretty sound. Indeed, Tekken music is pretty hype. Okay, similar start. Um, ooh. <laughs> Cheeky can right there. How did Zane blow himself up just now? Um, I think it was a down B from Samus. Oh, all right. Yeah, just like, summon the can right on it. <laughs> nice. So something I'm noticing, I think Train actually knows the uh, differences between the uh, five gunmen on Duck Hunt's down B because I've been seeing him react to... Uh, the different gunmen by being at like the right spacings or you know getting out of the way at the right time yeah oh my uh, god oh, definitely wow bro there was no way to get away from that that was so clutch from zane 2 because if they didn't close it out right there it could have been like the reverse of last game oh we need to look at that like he dodged the bandito perfectly and then zane was like i know he's gonna dodge it time for the oh can. and time this for, is oh. oof. Like Almost pigeons. got a really big string right there. I mean, that could honestly lead to death if Zade's super on point. And wow, Duck Hunt just does not care about your projectiles. He really Everything doesn't. Duck Hunt has just totally blocks it out. He just doesn't care. He's got three Hurtbox projectiles. That's crazy. And oh, kind of a misplay from Train. Let's see what. But Zane doesn't take it. Oh, never mind. This, this <laughs> is looking really rough right here. Bro, Train is working so hard not to get hit by any of this, though. Yeah, and in all that time of working hard, Zane just has not been hit for a really long time. Right oh. there, he got clipped by something, but still. 160 on train, and on the ledge again, now on the other side. Oh, good Ooh. dodge. Good evasion, but there it is. The back air comes out. Yeah, I, I, that missile was, I really don't agree with. Like, there was almost no chance you were hitting Zane with that. Putting um, trade on set point. Zane on set point. It's not over, though. You never know what'll happen. Yeah. I mean, ooh, oh. smart recovery right there. But still getting much uh, trapped. Ooh. That is interesting. If you totally, if you have a charge shot out right when 
Duck Hunt presses can. That can is so bugged. When it gets hit by a projectile, it just won't be hit by any more projectiles. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it seems like that. Like, it won't be launched by any more projectiles. It's so weird. There's the kill. Ooh. Yeah, Train's, I think Train has got a shot. Do you know if a small battlefield has smaller ceilings as well? It's FD. Okay. That seemed to kill. I guess uh, I think that up to super rage dependent. So uh -oh. had some percent. Oh, dodged that, it. Dodged I the second one. I think that would have been it, too. Oh, absolutely. The tipper, super strong. Oh, my God. Okay. We're in a, we're in a similar Train situation needs, again. Yeah. Train's getting the, uh, the momentum all of a sudden, but... That's the thing with Duck Hunt is, like, when you don't get that, like, confirm right there and close it out kind of early, then you're kind of fishing the whole time. Oh, gets the sour spot, which is <laughs> significantly <laughs> I was weaker. like, which way is that can going? <laughs> Up air. Oh, doesn't kill. Sam is so heavy. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm nice shot. Oh. Nice shot. Jesus. Oh. Oh, that's, that's, that's. That was a smart missile. That's a big Ooh, That'll kill. That'll kill. The Bandito is super strong. Wow. The shotgun taking out. Okay, and that was two close games, but Zane, you know, they've Indeed. been around. They've been around. They've been playing for a while. They have really good composure, able to close both out. Yo, look at this bandito come out. Boom. <laughs> yeah, and that grab, I think, could have been pretty smart if um, Train did manage to grab Duck Hunt right there and then armor the throw. Look but at this. Look at this man. Yeah, Zane just rolled right in because they knew the gunman would protect them. Now I want to like zoom in on his stupid face. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Look at Duck Hunt. All right, here's your face. Hello, everyone. Hello, Mario. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm gonna oh. stop the recording.